Hi, I'm Brian McCullough from BMC up in Minneapolis, Minnesota, and we are here at Reno at uh, MG 2011 with Bob Jensen, and he is also a, a, a Minnesotan. He's from uh, uh, what what city are you from? Stillwater. Stillwater, and uh, and, and Bob and I are both uh, members of the Minnesota MG Group, yep. and I'm a member of North American MG B Register. I used to be. I'm not anymore. And you're sure. MGA Register, MGA right? Register, Okay. Yeah. And I'm also the president of the MG Group. Okay. I will salute you. <laughs> no. But I'm sorry, not on camera. <laughs> so, right. Good. Good. So, so tell me, you have an MGA 1600 here? Yes. 1600 Mark II. 60, okay. 62 MGA 1600 Mark II. And we got this one in... Uh, 2004, and I bought one in 2003, but then my wife wanted one we could drive, so I bought this one. Okay. And uh, I've done everything on it to restore it, except for paint. Paint is original. Not original, but original as I got it. Okay. Uh, I put in a new engine I built, new uh, five-speed tranny, and uh, MGB rear end, chrome wires, new hubs, uh, everything I a little bit on the radiator because we, we travel a lot, so we want it to stay cool, which they're not good at. Okay. And w when did you install the 1800s? Uh, August of 2008. Okay. And you say? Uh, it was a basket case. Okay. It was literally a basket case. <laughs> you hear the stories, but this was a basket case. So we have an MGA yeah. 1600. 1622. 1622, so it's a Mark II. Two. Two. Right. Okay. Now with that, we already had disc brakes, and it has original yeah. disc brakes are still there, yep. original calipers. Yep. Uh, same rear end, same uh, gear ratios? No, rear end is an MGB 3.9. Okay, so it's... This came with 4.11, so 4.10 actually. It's just the pumpkin, not the, not the entire MGB. Just the pumpkin, yeah. Okay. And, uh, yeah, because this has got the pumpkin, I still remember. And uh, actually I sold the one that came out of it to a guy in Australia. And he was probably doing a T-Series, right? No, I think he was putting it in a Mark II. He wanted it. Well, he wanted it to gear his down. I don't remember if it was oh, a okay. Mark II okay. or not. Because a Mark II has a, the 410. And the other ones had uh, uh, three, uh, uh, 433. It's it's always the newer cars becoming the donor cars. The MGB yes. has, has its rear-end gear ratios stuck yep. in the MGAs. The MGAs yeah. have their gear ratios stuck in the T-Series. So Bob, thank you much for uh, thank you for your time. And uh, if we don't see you anymore here, we'll see you back in Minnesota.